and also directed uh, the government uh, to be able to find solutions, unconventional solutions, to be able to put them back on the track and also uh, support uh, those factories uh, to go back in their course and uh, in order to be able to empower the investment in Egypt. And of course, uh, he directed uh, the Prime Minister, Dr. Mustafa Madbouli, to study the means. With us on this very important topic, we have with us uh, live over the phone, uh, Mr. Abdul Latif Wahba, the political and economic analyst. Good morning, uh, Mr. Abdul Latif. Yeah, good morning. How are you doing, sir? Hi. So, Mr. Abdul Latif, uh, what are the main challenges or maybe problems uh, that has been facing uh, the struggling factories. Of course, in every country, some factors uh, meet the challenges, meet difficulties, they stop, they pause for a while, and then they pull themselves together, and they find, um, renew themselves, and they start operating again. So talk to us about uh, the most important challenges or uh, difficulties that face uh, those uh, struggling factories. Um, as you know, <coughs> sorry, as you know, after um, uh, or, uh, uh, at the beginning of uh, uh, 20 uh, or uh, 2011, uh, and after the uh, revolutions, you know that uh, uh, some uh, factories. Uh, uh, suffered from uh, the financial issues. Uh, this uh, the the first problem, and at the same time uh, there uh, were deteriorations in the economic situations here in Egypt, and uh, many uh, or some uh, some factories. Uh, um, in different sectors all over uh, Egypt uh, suffered at the same time from the shortage of the raw materials they used in their uh, uh, networks and so on. Um, and uh, uh, as you know that uh, also that uh, uh, President Abdel Fattah Sisi, since uh, uh, he came to power, um, asked the, the government uh, to support uh, these factories and to help them uh, to go back uh, uh, on the right way or uh, the economic uh, track. Uh, uh, and uh, the cabinet with the uh, cooperations of uh, uh, of uh, other uh, utilities like uh, uh, industrials uh, federations uh, and the chamber of commerce and so on held the mini meeting to uh, to uh, face uh, this problem uh, first of all uh, they uh, uh, were uh, trying to support them by uh, providing some uh, facilities uh, or financial uh, facilities uh, and uh, to uh, solve all the problems they, uh, they faced uh, during the, uh, the last period. Um, uh, during uh, last week, uh, President Abdel Fattah Sisi uh, uh, in his meeting with the prime ministers and the, some ministers and the economic minister group, uh, uh, they asked the government uh, to um, to increase its support uh, for uh, these uh, uh, factories uh, as they are trying to empower. Uh, the um, uh, the local uh, industries uh, to meet uh, the uh, the uh, the local uh, domestic demand uh, from uh, some industries and at the same time uh, uh, um, directed uh, the, the the government to continue at the same time uh, in Solving the uh, the 
<coughs> the uh, administrative uh, problems they faced at the same time, sir. And um, uh, let us say that uh, uh, in some uh, period, uh, some uh, factories hold uh, its work. This is because uh, the uh, raw materials or for the fina uh, because of uh, financial uh, problems uh, or uh, a dispute between uh, the owner uh, themselves. Uh, this is according to the surveys the cabinet uh, uh, made during the, the last period. So they are insisting, I mean the cabinet and the ministers, uh, uh, to solve all the problems and issues they faced during the, the, the uh, last years and to put them uh, on the uh, right way again. Right. So, um, uh, how important is it to study those files and can this uh, study uh, that was uh, according to the directives of President Abdel Fattah Sisi, um, this plan or this study or this strategy, could it be able to uh, put them on the right track in the near uh, future, right soon, or uh, the problems should, be, uh, should involve some other sectors, not only the government? I mean, it should involve some uh, investors, uh, some change of strategy inside the factory itself. I mean, uh, to cope with the uh, modern state of the art uh, factories. Uh, I mean, there are uh, m more, m more than one factor that define the success of any uh, um, I mean, industry in any country. So, if you like to elaborate on that. Uh, yeah, of course, uh, um, um, uh, as you said, mm. they, um, uh, the cabinet um, uh, 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 hold many meetings uh, for these factories and also at the same time uh, ask the, the, uh, the um, governor uh, in many, uh, uh, many uh, governorates uh, uh, to provide the, uh, the, 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 the government to, and the Prime Minister Madbouli with uh, the names and the sectors of these uh, uh, factories uh, that work as them. Uh, they, um, uh, according to uh, the cabinet, uh, they uh, are trying uh, to support them, uh, um, especially in coordination with uh, some initiatives from uh, the central bank uh, for uh, the uh, factors uh, that uh, faced financial uh, problems. And at the same time, they are trying to help them or to provide them with the raw materials uh, they um, uh, the, uh, with raw materials, and uh, this is of course not. Uh, uh, it is an important plan uh, to revive and uh, to recover uh, the, the, this uh, uh, this industry, not only for the Egyptian uh, economy, uh, but at the same time, as you know that. Uh, 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 to, uh, many uh, Egyptians uh, were uh, working in these uh, factories, so they can uh, serve the uh, Egyptian economy, uh, the local, uh, the local uh, markets uh, to provide the local markets uh, with its needs, and at the same time uh, to um, to play. Uh, another rule in uh, uh, decreasing the unemployment uh, 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 rate uh, in uh, Egyptian societies. Uh, uh, this is, of course, uh, uh, as you, you mentioned, they supported not only uh, 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 with the financial uh, aid, but at the same time, uh, uh, in providing them with the, uh, with infrastructures again, 
uh, like electricity, like water, like and uh, and so on. This is uh, the core element of these uh, factories. But uh, it depends upon the problem they faced. As we said, some suffered from financial uh, uh, crisis, uh, others from uh, the raw uh, materials, or uh, at the speed between partners. Uh, uh, and so on. Uh, so the government is working uh, to facilitate and to face all the problem uh, these uh, sectors or the closed uh, 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 factories or industries uh, faced during the last, uh, the, uh, the last years. Uh, this is uh, 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 according to uh, the, 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 the meeting uh, or the continued meeting between the uh, 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 headed by President Fatah Sisi and his directions to all uh, ministries uh, to um, solve the problem. Right. The President also talked about preserving the rights of uh, the laborers uh, or the workers' rights. Uh, which is a very important element inside this uh, um, topic. Um, when we talk about whole, uh, uh, a whole factory that uh, might be uh, providing, uh, I mean, livelihoods for uh, thousands of workers uh, with the capacity of that factory, add to that how many factories inside each country. So uh, this is uh, going to be a real problem in society when uh, there is a layoff uh, for uh, workers because of uh, uh, stoppage in the course of, uh, uh, I mean, uh, work of a certain factory. This affects other, the lives of other people too. So if you like to talk about uh, the dangers of halting uh, the work of a factory, uh, the impact over human beings, over the livelihoods of people, of affecting uh, the uh, low-income brackets, the workers that are um, working there. Is there any compensation in that um, sense, I mean, in that case? Yes. Uh, it is an important point uh, you mentioned. Um, and if we uh, uh, make a flashback on the, uh, on, the, uh, on the situations of these uh, uh, factories or industries and so on, you will find that President Fatah Sisi, um, in, uh, 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 when he was uh, uh, discussing the problem of the cabinet, uh, and uh, uh, he declared it in, uh, uh, in some... Uh, uh, events of, and uh, inaugurations of uh, projects in other Egypt or uh, in some minister, uh, in some uh, uh, governorates, uh, he directed the government, first of all, to establish uh, uh, to establish uh, um, a body. Uh, to uh, compensate the, uh, uh, the labor forces of these uh, uh, closed uh, industries uh, and at the same time established a fund uh, for, uh, for, uh, to help them, to help the, uh, the workers as they are at the same time or uh, responsible uh, for uh, families uh, here, and uh, you remember exactly at the same time uh, President Fatah Sisi um, uh, asked the government for an employment uh, 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 help, uh, financial help uh, to uh, support these people until uh, they uh, face uh, the problem or they solve the, uh, the problem uh, and so on. This is the same, uh, the same system and the style uh, the, the cabinet followed uh, during, for example, uh, 
كورونا كورونا تايم when they supported the seasonal workers here in Egypt and also the closed factories and so on. This is, of course, it is a temporary help for the workers of these factories until they put it uh, on the uh, track again. To put it back on track again, right. So yeah. when, when we talk about uh, um, looking into that particular uh, uh, issue, which is the halt of the uh, course, uh, working course of a certain factory, then we can study, I mean, from the government's um, uh, perception, we have, we'll have to study the livelihoods of uh, uh, people uh, in society, I mean the workers. We'll have to study also the factors of uh, losing uh, um, the uh, incentives uh, for uh, foreign investment or domestic investment on any type of investment when this uh, factory stops. We also will have to uh, also uh, uh, study the facts or the factors of uh, losing one um, great deal of venue uh, for uh, income uh, for the country. So the Egypt used to have very popular uh, factories and very popular industry for years, for almost like 50 or 60 years, especially in fabrics. Uh, something that is concerning cotton because Egypt is a very rich source of uh, organic uh, uh, cotton and other uh, types of uh, um, products like oils, uh, organic oils, like uh, some types of uh, um, rich agriculture that could be manufactured into other products. So if you like to also focus on this. Uh, yeah, of course, as you know that um, um uh, during the problem, uh, at the same time, sir, um, uh, 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 the cabinet um, uh, trained again uh, the, uh, the, 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 the workers and the labor forces in the country uh, in the uh, industries or uh, factories uh, that, uh, uh, that uh, stopped during the last period and uh, trained them for, uh, or uh, to help them to uh, articulate another uh, sectors, uh, especially uh, uh, the, 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 the transferring uh, or uh, transitional uh, process, sorry, transitional uh, process uh, to, uh, to train uh, the, uh, the, the administrative uh, workers uh, uh, in uh, these factories uh, uh, to um, uh, uh, to become uh, uh, um, a productions uh, or uh, workers in another uh, utilities. Uh, this is, of course, uh, uh, to uh, help all uh, kind of workers. Uh, uh, that worked in uh, who worked uh, uh, in these factories. Uh, so, uh, um, uh, in many uh, sectors, as you mentioned, uh, they uh, trained them. Uh, they are trying to uh, uh, exploit them in, uh, in another uh, uh, activities, economic activities, and so on. And this is uh, what happened. Uh, in the uh, some factories uh, uh, that were uh, uh, liquefied during the last uh, period, uh, like Mr. Um, uh, Mr. Halwan uh, for iron and steel and so on. Uh, so um, the, the, the cabinet, uh, according to uh, order from President the Fatah said they didn't leave the workers, uh, but they compensated uh, them at the same time. Uh, the worker who wants uh, 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 pensions, it's okay. Uh, 
uh, the workers who want to be retrained uh, uh, and then um, articulated to another uh, section or another uh, sector in the state uh, or in the public uh, companies, they agreed uh, and so on. Uh, this is, uh, I think, uh, to help uh, the workers and to help their families uh, uh, and um, to help their uh, families uh, member at the same time uh, uh, because uh, uh, according to uh, the cabinet and according to uh, President Abdel Fattah Sisi, the, the workers uh, are not mm. alone, uh, but they are living in a society mm. and are living with their uh, families uh, and helping their families in everything, in education, in health and so on. Right. On that note, of course, Mr. Abdel Latif Wahba, you are an economic and a political analyst. would like to thank you, sir, so much for talking to us on The Breakfast Show. And we're going to go uh, to a short break. But before uh, we go to a short break, uh, of course, uh, we will have to uh, move on uh, to another uh, segment, which is the new Alameen city. The new Alameen city, you've all heard about the new Alameen city. However, uh, many might not know that the new Alameen city is named after uh, an old uh, one that lies also uh, in Egypt's north coast and which has an international reputation. And we have more details coming up in the following report. El Alamein is a town in the northern Matruh Governorate of Egypt. Located on the Mediterranean Sea, it lies 106 kilometers west of Alexandria and 300 kilometers northwest of Cairo. El Alamein's climate is less hot because of the prevailing Mediterranean sea winds. Two important world war battles